Going in the corner right there. He just Ooh. gets a touch. Right, ooh, and the back end gets off the gas. Was that Man. Tony Stewart that he made contact with Rodney? And through the grass. Boy, those roof laps really did their job then because that car wanted to take off. It sure did. And uh, you can see that Robbie Gordon is having a uh, what appears to be a heated conversation with Tony Stewart. There you see Gordon sliding on the apron of the racetrack. And Dale Jarrett just did get through the middle part of that wreck. Here we see Robbie Gordon, the 13, Matt Kenseth in the 17, the yellow car right behind. He has a leader there. We see the contact. And around goes Robbie Gordon. No, just nail the gas. And it helps some, but not enough. Yeah, I don't know. They can go that long without a caution or not. Martin Mark goes in the corner behind Robbie Gordon, but Robbie just loses control going down in the corner, nails the gas, tried to keep it off the wall, and almost succeeded. Gordon operating with a new crew chief this week here at Talladega. I mean, at uh, Martinsville, Jerry Baxter has taken over duties from Fred Graves. Right there is where the trouble is going to start. He makes contact with Robbie Gordon. He goes down, hits, I guess that's the seven. Seven of Michael Waltrip, and then, look, there's just no place to go as those guys come across the racetrack. As the smoke goes up, there's nowhere to go except in the side of another car. There we see him going down the corner. Starts on the outside, and that right front, he just went flat. He never turned, and then that wall he went. Robbie Gordon was evasive when we asked him during qualifying yesterday if he was going to run the Indianapolis 500, but the release from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway says he is. The tire is on the right front. is still blazing there, BP. I'll tell you what. Now, that right front tire changer, he gets my vote. <laughs> he gets my vote. He went in there and took that tire off with it on fire. There's Benny's hero of the night. The blazing tire of Robbie Gordon was taken off. Everything's okay. Back in a moment. Well, you remember a couple months ago, Robbie Gordon and his team decided to kind of uh, take a break as such and get things in order, pick and choose their races. Well, Robbie, after starting 42nd today, you come home with a fourth place finish, tying your career best. I guess you had a lot of fun out there. I don't know, a lot of fun and a lot of work. Um, you know, we passed a lot of cars, and unfortunately, we, we damaged up the front end a little bit, lost a little bit of front downforce. Um, hats off to Steve. Excellent job. Comes off the corner, the car gets sideways, but he turns it back and corrects it corrects the car and it comes back across and goes straight up into the wall as the right window blows out. We are under caution. Robbie Gordon has crashed in turn two. Seventh yellow of the race comes out at lap 183. 